Out of date says there'll be consequences of the war, but there are more pressing matters at hand. The last World Eater has been left undisturbed with the tree while you focused on the war. He thought someone with your light perspective and key would have had different priorities and faced the World Eaters before resolving the tribe war. Regardless, Out of Date is grateful the tribe war is over. Out of Date understands the road has been rough, but you already know what's left to end this journey, and it'll be tough. You're the only one that's strong enough to face the last World Eater. The future depends on someone with a light perspective to give the world a chance to survive. Only time will tell what the future holds, and if it will bring a lasting peace for those that make it to the end. Out of date reminds you it's time to confront the last world eater. Never know what's hiding out in the dark. She figured you'd have given up by... Says she makes her own friends from whole cloth and sometimes uses them to affect her not-so-friends. Now that you're here, Maya believes your fate might be bigger than she thought. The world might end you, but it won't end without you. If you're going to save the world, you'd better get moving. Can't just sit there on pins and needles. They'll stab right through you. Either way, she wishes you luck. Good, bad, or whatever you need. Asks if you ever wondered who might... Thinks that's awfully easy for you to think fate's pulling your strings. Whoever's in charge, they seem to be steering the world into the trash. Thinks it's funny how hard you meant to improve things, no matter the result. 
Kiki, Coco, Tao, Roya, Pap, the people, Lums, Gopa. Says she loves the Jagni. Duri, Tani, Kati, Munda, Gori, Tani, Folani. Thinks that's true. They say a lot about those who wear them. Roti, roti le si, si le roto. Anyhow, she has funner things to talk about. Koritani Folani. Says her name is Maya. She doesn't get a lot of visitors nowadays. There's a jumbie hex over these parts of the land. Rokautansi. Wala putawantani. Tausi kauru. She's beyond worry though and knows there's a small chance you'll survive. You're all doomed if you don't. Paso, fipilo, glum. Maya won't give up or give in. She thinks it's better to... Koritani, Folani, Gardina, Rutitizi. Says they start that way, but with a little hexing of her own, they can affect a lot more than your imagination. Saturi, Karumile. Roya Papti Pippo. She's crafted a poppet in defense against the world eater closest to her, but she needs a sharper pinpricker to make use of it. She's flurfed the poppet already, so there's no need to worry about her wishcraft. It's primed on the world eater. The only pinpricker worth using is one that was stuck in a haystack. Thanks you for trusting in her poppet powers. Let's see. Nature here is overwhelming. The Hex Hut. Maya makes her home here. A fixer upper. Wonder what's left of it. You found an old brick brack. Might be worth exploring. It's a game of life, yours and everyone else's.
That straw barn should hold enough hay to find the pinpricker. You need to re-plug the cable so each match the sequence. Nice. That rearrangement should be enough to let enough electric current pass through the board. Everything is at stake.
shield your eyes if the daylight hurts you. Finding that pinpricker is going to be like looking for a needle in a haystack. The night feels dangerous and exciting. You move with such confidence. Night falls like a giant around here.
zip fiddy doo dah This story is about a hero. Just a few moves left. Make them count. The night is ending soon. That looks exactly like the pinprick Amaya was talking about.
Kikoko Taosi. Ford's Ford play. Maya looks relieved as she's finally able to get to work on the poppet. It'll take some pinpricking to soften up the world eater. Masumi Melemelo Slopse Prupa. Maya says there's a jar roaming in the mushy mire at night. She wants to catch and bind it to a protection poppet. Wasi Ruma Guanawa. This time she wants to use a snuggy poppet from an old world automated blind box dispenser to bind the jar. Once you've got a snuggy poppet from a machine, go to the mushy mosh mire and catch the job before you come back here. Says being kind can hurt you, but she's happy to take advantage of that. Maya says she'll stick around. Kupleko Hexi Wet says goodbye to you. 